Hey everybody, I'm CBS News Texas First Alert Meteorologist Demetrius Brown and many of you have been wondering about when fall is going to begin. We can we can get rid of the hot weather and expect some cooler conditions. We've had an exceptionally hot summer and dry summer, so things are about to change. Hang on a little while longer, but that first day of fall is coming. So as we look at it, you'll see what the weather computer here in the screen, the autumnal equinox. That's the first day of fall happening on September 23rd at 1:50 in the morning. It is coming now as we look ahead, we always talk about the change of the seasons and it's all dependent on the tilt of the earth on its axis. So when the northern hemisphere is tilted toward the sun, that's when we have our summers here in Texas. But for the equinoxes, like the autumnal equinox, the sun will directly have its rays over the equator. So that means we're going to have about 12 hours of daylight and 12 hours of darkness once we head into the first day of fall and thereafter. So something to keep in mind here, sunrise on the first day of fall at 716 in the morning, sunset at 723 in the evening. So that's nearly 12 hours of day and night, something that will be a little different for us since we've been in the summer months. Now, when we also talk about the first day of fall, many of you think it's going to turn cool instantly. That's just not the case. So I crunched some numbers over the past 30 years or so at DFW Airport for the first day of fall. Last year, 2022, first day of fall, 98 degrees for high temperatures. In 2021, 83. How about 2020, 70 degrees. And then 2019, it was 96 degrees. Now, one of the hottest first days of fall back in 2005 at DFW Airport, 101, the coolest in 1995 at 68 degrees. When we talk about fall, we also talk about the fall colors, and it's going to take a little while to have those leaves changing here in Texas. If you're looking for some fall colors, you might have to go visit another state for that early on, but wait a little while longer here in Texas. It will take until about maybe the last week of October into the month of November. That's when we start to see peak colors and peak times here in our area. So it's climbing, just hang on a little while longer for that too. And many of you have asked how about this daylight saving time is going to end Sunday, November 5th, early, early in the morning. Set your clocks back one hour before going to bed. It happens about two o'clock in the morning. First alert meteorologist Demetrius Brown here. Stay with the first alert weather team for constant updates with your first alert forecast.